Hi, Shalonda Gordon here coming to you straight from Atlanta, Georgia, and it's day 20 of the Rise Up 2015 video blogging challenge. It's a 21 day challenge. So as you know, tomorrow is the last day of this challenge, but no worries, no worries. I'm still going to keep coming to you yet. Everything's going to kind of switch over to how you can create your own new child support system so if you think that's something you're interested in make sure you keep coming back yet if you know child support isn't really something you're into which might be the case that's fine too just make sure you share the link new child support system with every single mom you know every single dad you know anybody who owes child support or deserves to get child support make sure they know the link newchildsupportsystem.com because I'm going to be showing you exactly how to create your own child support system just like I did. Now, let's get into day 20 and what the question is for today. Drum roll, please. Kind of goes along with what I just was talking about. What do you want your legacy to be? What do you want your legacy to be? Well, I'll be honest with you as a single mom, I strive to basically leave something for my children. I want for when I'm long gone that they have plenty to work with, not just for themselves, but for my grandkids and great grandkids. That's the legacy I want to leave for my family, but it doesn't stop there. I want to be able to see other single moms kids be able to say you know my mom met Shalonda Gordon and because of that meeting she learned to create her own child support system and in essence created a lifestyle that we were able to have that I'm able to now have my own business I want to see children of single moms all over the world being able to create a whole entirely new lifestyle not just financially but based on the reality of what it takes to be a single parent I want to see these kids desiring marriage I want to see these children desiring a different lifestyle not that being a single mom is a bad thing at all yet I'm gonna be honest with you I'm raising two daughters and more than anything I would desire for them to be married first and then have children I would desire for them to understand that it never was meant for a woman to run ever everything by herself right that's what I desire that's that's my truth living it every single day and my daughter is just really wanting the best for them not just half or three-fourths or a little bit no no I want them to have the best and I believe the best is having a companion someone who you can grow with someone who loves you so much that when you look at your child together you see that love in that situation so I want to be able to say when I'm long and gone that there are many, many adults out there whose moms were single moms who were connected with me, who we talked together, we grew together, hearts were healed together, and truths were understood together. Really, responsibility was accepted, right? So that lives were made better and different. A different journey was chosen to be taken. Not saying that that journey had to, that, that, that road that was shown had to be taken, but at least that option was given because it was known right I always say you know I'm a single mom and I say you know I made decisions by the time I realized what all it took I was already a mom you know I made decisions without having all the information first right <laughs> and usually when you're young you know, I have my first child at 25 when you're young you do things like that right but that's okay I want to make sure that we're able to get that information out there so that our kids single moms out here today that our kids aren't making decisions lacking information right that's what I desire my legacy to be so I want to know what do you desire for your legacy to be go ahead click the button under this video get your blog do the 21 day challenge and tell me what it is what do you want your legacy to be but for now I'm gonna call out Apple Daniels Carlton Riddick and Adrian Hines alright talk to you later have an amazing day keep smiling bye